What's going on guys? Welcome back to another video here at Studio 1024. First of all, I just want to say thank you to uh, everybody who's been checking out the channel and the videos. Uh, whether you just randomly came across it or you thought the thumbnail was cool. My Bring Me video kind of popped off. Uh, 700 plus views isn't like a lot for YouTube, but I'll take it as a new newer YouTuber. Thank you guys for checking it out and thinking I'm cool enough to hit the subscribe. That's pretty, pretty exciting. And I'm glad you guys are here. It's kind of funny. This is the first time I feel like I'm actually talking to people. It's nice to know that you're not just a crazy person talking to a camera. <laughs> I didn't film anything last week. Uh, it was kind of a boring week for me. And, but I posted the bring me video and I actually when I was filming that this that same Friday This song came out and I wanted to check it out as you guys know by the title uh, Polaris, I'm not very familiar with them, but I really wanted to check this song out because I Liked a few songs off of the death of me their previous album. I like their sound and I you know just wanted to check them out, see what their new stuff sounds like, uh, see how they progress as a band. Yeah, I, I don't really know much about them, so I don't really have anything to say before we get into the video, but I think they're Australian. That's about all I know about them. Before we get into this video, if you guys are new here, hop on the train, hit the subscribe button. You know, we're going to have some fun. You're going to like it. So <laughs> anyway, let's get into this. I like that bass line. That's a nice bass tone. It's like perfect. Not too gritty. Oh! Oh, dude, the bounciness of this song. Already. Oh my god. Such a subtle change, but it's like... I think this is a chorus. Such a consistent song. Man, just a full screamer, dude. Okay. Bit of solo action here. Yes. Oh. <laughs> yes, dude. Oh, 
Shit. Oh yeah, there we go. I think that's halftime from the original chorus, right? Jeez, dude. The entire time is just disgusted face. The entire time. <laughs> dude, that one was so fun. I don't know why this one hasn't been blowing up. That was crazy. Uh, Yeah, I really like that one. Didn't really know what to expect because I know this guy, he screams a lot. But I know in the death of me, he does a lot of singing. We got a full screamer, dude. We got a full screamer. There were a little bit of cleans in there somewhere. But I apologize if I was bouncing the entire time because... That, that's what this song is. It's like a just headbanging from zero to four minutes. Let's talk about tone. Comparing to The Death of Me, I really like this tone better. The Death of Me had a, a, I think it was the drums for me. The drum tones were a little different and that's fine. They weren't my favorite, but this is really good. I think everybody kind of in the scene is kind of like honing in on this modern metal sound and I like where it's headed as I said earlier in the song I think uh, when I when it first went to the chorus it, it was the same it was like the, it had the same vibe but it was you could tell it was a chorus and that was really cool to have a consistent song throughout usually in metal I just heard Nick Nocturnal talk about how he went to play the river with wage war and he was like i didn't realize there were no repeating parts it's just like 14 different parts usually that's what it is in metal is like there's you know 20 different guitar parts there's you know the chorus stays the same or whatever this was really cool because it was consistent but every part was a little bit different it had the same vibe but it just had its own aura about it Production wise, uh, I really liked it. There were a lot of layers. All, all the space was filled. I know there were a few parts in The Death of Me that I kind of was like iffy about because the production was kind of, uh, there were a few little parts that were kind of empty. Sometimes that's good, but I really like when you can fill out a mix, not make it sound muddy or anything, but just fill out a mix and make it feel full. It adds to the atmosphere of the song. Uh, the lyrics, the I didn't really catch a lot of the lyrics because he was screaming. Just from reading it, it's like um, just kind of the idea of going numb and, you know, just waiting waiting on death's door you know it's a common theme this is a common theme i think in the metal industry is writing about pain and you know depression and in numbness and all this but just from the uh like the metaphors in this song they're different we all have the same feelings a lot of the time so it's okay to write about the same stuff but when you can take the same stuff that we've been writing for 20 some years now, but make it your own and write it in a new way and differently, it, that's that's really cool. Lyric, lyricism, lyric, lyricism? Am I saying that right? Lyricism? Lyric, 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 anyway. Sure, somebody look that up. And that's, that's a big part of you know, being an artist and uh, you could have some really great music, but if your lyrics suck, then it's like, eh, you know? <laughs> so I think that's about it for this one. I don't really have much to say about Polaris. I don't follow them really. I don't know them, but I thought it would be cool, uh, especially for this channel, this type of channel. I'm, you know, trying to branch out a little bit. I know uh, a few of you were giving me, bring me recommendations and I've hopped into that a little bit, uh, just the older stuff. So yeah, maybe I'll hop into Polaris a little bit more, see what their discography looks like. It looks like here they've got a third album coming called Fatalism. So that's out September 1st from this song. I'm pretty excited about that. Anyway, I think that's it for this video, guys. Thank you guys for watching. If you're new and you're still watching, hit the subscribe button. Come on, you want to. If you like this video, leave a like, uh, leave a comment. Let me know what you want to see. 
if you guys have a recommendation that you uh, of a band that you want me to check out leave that down below and maybe you want to see some other stuff I'm a musician myself so maybe some you know production videos or anything like that or maybe just something about me I think that's gonna do it for this one guys thank you for watching and I will see you in the next one